Alrighty, we're in the kitchen today with Chef Robert Arnold from Distinctive Gourmet at the Virginia Beach Convention Center. Yes, the big, beautiful convention center awesome at the oceanfront. You know, awesome building, awesome uh, place to hold all kinds of things. And the food is pretty darn good, Robert. Yes, sir, we do. We uh, try to take it top notch, keep it high end, uh, mm -hmm. stuff that you wouldn't normally get, not your regular go of the mill buffet, fried fish. Dry turkey. Yeah, every time I've been there for whatever it is, a banquet or an event or something like that, the food has always been phenomenal. And you're going to tell us why and how. And what are you going to cook for us today? Uh, I'm doing a little shrimp and grits. This is our signature recipe. Uh, my executive chef, Paul Benson, and myself sat down. It mm -hmm. took us a little while, but uh, people seem to love it. They come back for it. And so hopefully everybody here will enjoy it. But Robert, you do so much more, and we'll talk about that in just a few minutes. So stick around. Robert's going to get cooking in just a moment. Alrighty, we're back in the kitchen with Chef Robert Arnold from Distinctive Gourmet at the Virginia Beach Convention Center. Robert is a first timer here on the Hampton Road Show. Welcome to the Hampton Road Show. Thanks for having me, guys. You didn't realize this, but first timers always get to clean out the, the, the uh, refrigerator when you're here. <laughs> Did you know that? Yeah, I'll be sure to do that. When it's, and it's loaded up for you. First timers get the, uh, the uh, refrigerator. But listen, we're really excited to have you here uh, from the Convention Center making one of your uh, signature dishes. Yes, what sir. are you making for us? We're going to do a little bit of shrimp and grits here. Um, this is basically something that Executive Chef Paul Vincent and myself, mm -hmm. we spent time uh, searching around, going through it. It came up from the south, I guess, Shrimp and Grits did. It was very explosive a couple years ago, so yeah. we figured we'd want to get in on that and uh, have some of that action. Like I said, at the convention center, we try to keep it up notch. So I'm just going to do a little bit of cooking here for you when we get started. Uh, well, already... Before we jump into a Distinctive uh, Gourmet at the convention center, tell us a little about that. Um, distinctive Gourmet, we're the caterers for the convention center. Mm -hmm. um, we do... Uh, like I said, anything from bar mitzvahs, weddings, um, top-notch uh, weddings. Um, when I first started there, we were doing very minimal weddings, right. maybe five a year. I think we're up to over 50 now. Very nice. Um, we do the Val Bridal Show. Um, we also do a lot of military groups. Sure. Uh, um, Marine Corps balls, uh, both the younger enlisted and the senior enlisted come in. Uh, we usually get both of those every year. Uh, Christmas parties, um, things of that nature. Uh, I, pretty much anything anybody's willing to. Nothing too small, nothing too big. That's convention, right. special events, you name it, they do it there at the convention center. Say, so, Robert, go ahead and get to started with this and tell us what sets your uh, shrimp and grits apart from everybody else. I, I think basically what gets us a little different is the extra bit of love we put in it. You know okay. what I mean? Because love's you. very important. Yep. We just start off with a little bit of oil in the pan there. Um, plus, you know, everybody does it a little different. We use a stone ground grit. Um, it's mm -hmm. a little bit bigger grit. It's uh, got a little more bite to it, a little more earthiness. So we're going to start a little garlic. Just let that sweat in the pan a little. Need a little more heat. Now, are you like, we've had so many different styles of shrimp and grits. Some are spicy, some are, uh, you know, cooked to taste. How, how does yours uh, end up? A little spicy well, or what? We, we go a little spicy. We're not okay. trying to kill the public, right. like I said. So we know we're feeding everybody. We're feeding the masses. Right. So we definitely don't want to. Myself, I would take it to the extreme. I like a lot of heat. But, right. uh, you know, when you do this, you learn to take everything back a notch. A little garlic, a little peppers here. Also, we also found we use this tasso ham, which has got a nice smoky consistency to it. Also, a little bit of spice, uh, so that way I don't go. have to take it up too much. There you go. Well, that um, seems like that would really set it apart. That right there. gives it a little bit of a secret dish kickoff, mm -hmm. like I said, and kick Great the seat up color, a little Robert. more. And then, of course, we got some beautiful shrimp here. Throw those right in. We uh, this is called Blackfish Magic. You can get this in any store. It's Paul Perdone seasoning. Um, we call it Fat Man in a Can. Fat Man in a Can. You know, we so, all know Paul Perdon. Yes. Yeah, it almost looks kind of like Old Bay. A little bit. A little bit. Kind of similar. A um, seafood. little salt and pepper here. A little salt and pepper. Never hurts. Okay, so uh, that looks already it looks good. Just, uh, yeah, we we'll take this. We're going to cook it. Keep this heat high. Once you get a nice simmer going, we're going to deglaze with a little bit of white wine. Uh -huh. and let that roll. We're going to take it back down to almost a dry pan. Right. Hit it with a little heavy cream, a little butter to finish. Um, that's basically it. We can start off here with this simmer for a little while. Like okay, well, uh, while you're still cooking, tell me a little about yourself. How long have you been uh, in the chef world? Oh, I have been doing this for about the last 20, 22 years. Oh, wow. Yeah, I, I came up. I don't have a degree or anything. I started as a dishwasher. And the, um, but you just, learned as you went. Just learn as you go. I yeah. tell a lot of people um, at the convention center that work for me were a, a learning teaching kitchen. So sure. I like to give back. I mean, a lot was given to me as a dishwasher when the next man uh, was sick or couldn't come to work. You, know, right. you want to step up and do pantry. You want to learn this. So I just kind of took it with that and ran. What do you like about it? Um, 
It's got to be I, some I'm great a, satisfaction. I, I'm an art guy. Right. I like to draw. I like to do paint and things like that. So it almost, it's food palette, you know, it's, yeah. it's plated, plated beauty. Um, I think I have a passion for it. I really enjoy it. I enjoy the challenges, you know. Yeah. Um, I was, my background was in restaurants. Uh, coming to the convention center was my first experience doing right. high, high volume. Um, Paul Benson taught me a lot. So now I can only imagine that the challenge is if it's high volume to, to make sure every dish tastes the same and delicious. It's, it's extremely hard. And, and honestly, it's all about the timing. Right. You got to get everything down so your execution's perfect. And uh, we, we have a top notch team. We've nailed that. And uh, yeah. so anytime you guys want to come down and check us out, we'd love to have you. So in. nothing too small, nothing too large at the Virginia Convention Center. Yes, sir. There you have it. All right. So we're going to wrap up the uh, shrimp and grits with Robert Arnold for just, in just a few minutes. So stick around. Looks good. Thank you, sir. Let's we are back in the kitchen with Chef Ron and Oliver from Distinctive Gourmet at the Virginia Beach Convention Center, and he's wrapping up his shrimp and grits. And just seconds ago, he added his cream. Uh, a little like there, seconds right. before we're back on air. <laughs> but that's all right, Ronald. Uh, uh, Robert, so tell me, what are you doing now, and how are you wrapping it up? Because it looks delicious. Oh, we just took this down, uh -huh. reduced our wine out, took it almost down to a dry pan. Of course, heavy cream. Uh -huh. And let this come back up to a simmer. Um, this is about the final touch. Uh, I've already re-seasoned, re-tasted, make sure it's good. Uh -huh. you do me a favor, you want to throw that cheese and those grits right there for okay, me? Okay, so these uh, these cheese grits right here. Yes, sir. Okay, and a little bit of stir. It's a little stir. A little bit we, of stir. We use a stone ground grit instead of a, a, a fine a white grit. Yeah. It gives it a little more bite, a little more crunch. It takes a little while to cook. That's why I had to get them going before everything. Um, that's our base for our sauce here. Okay, so look, get, let's get back to the sauce. Uh, tell me what, tell everybody once again what's in your... Uh, in the shrimp portion of your grits. We just started with a little bit of white wine, uh -huh. I mean, a little olive oil, garlic, um, fat man in a can, as I call it. Fat Chef, man in a can. Chef Paul Perdone's uh, Blackfish Magic, salt, pepper. I have um, nice peppers here, red, green, yellow, and onion, and a, and a Spanish onion. And uh, like I said, our, our secret is a little bit of tasso ham, which is a slow smoked Mexican uh, ham. Very delicious. Don't you wish you were a fat man in a can? Yes, yeah, sometimes. Think about the money on, on that little can right there. Okay, so um, it almost looks ready. I know you're just getting it, uh, heating it up a little bit more so you can add it together. But once again, tell us what's happening there at Distinctive Gourmet at the Virginia Beach Convention Center. Uh, you know, we, we do anything that you guys want to bring to us. Mm -hmm. uh, we're just trying to get out there, trying to get away from the normal, typical, you know, convention food. We want right. to get our name out there. We, you know, anything from or mitzvahs to weddings, anything that you want to bring. Um, we do a lot of chicken. Um, we try to stay on the end. We, we make that's a big joke because it's right. inexpensive, but we do a lot of chicken. Try to make it different. We stay on the, the new culinary tips. Chef and I are constantly reading, constantly looking out for what the new trends are. Right, and, and it might be just with the sauces. Our sauces, we got a wide variety. I mm -hmm. think that's a lot of the appeal we have. Uh, goes from one end to the next. We do have our own herb garden, oh, our own vegetable nice. garden there. We do a lot of heirloom tomatoes. Very uh, nice. So on smaller events, we can make our own uh, dressings and things of that nature. Um, Majority of lettuces we can get. If it's a smaller event, we do the lettuces in-house, uh, beefsteak tomatoes, heirloom tomatoes, uh, thyme, rosemary. We, we've got it all out there. Now, I know you cater so many different events. Next month, you guys are going to be slammed with graduates from all across the beach. Yeah, always. Always. There are going to be so us. many graduations next week. Okay, so um, your staff, as little as how many and as big as, as what? Uh, in, in the wintertime, which is usually our, our busier season, mm -hmm. I, I'll have 30 in my kitchen. Right now, i got about 27 of them in there. Uh, Desiree Neal, my uh, production chef, yeah. what's going on, the whole crew, they're there doing uh, production for 1200 for Liberty Tax uh, Thursday and Friday. Fair so enough. They're there busting their chops. What's on the menu for that? Um, we have um, a, a potato station. It's, it's a lot of people coming in, so we got a lot of different stations going on. We're Very doing nice. a pulled pork nacho station. Very um, nice. We got a, a, a potato bar. We've got all kinds of different things going on. Just like I said, trying to keep it new and fresh. All right, Robert, any more shout outs to anybody over there at the convention? Uh, no, that's about it. You know, just that and, and my great crew that's sitting out there, uh, my sales team. We know you're out there. Yeah. Couldn't make it in. Too busy in here. Mom. Listen, go ahead and uh, put a plate it up real quick, and uh, we're going to wrap this segment up. Shrimp and grits with Robert Arnold. Oh, you were going to give Mom a shout out? Oh, yeah, Mom's Come on. out there too. How you doing, Mom? How you doing, Mom? <laughs> Robert's Virginia Beach guy. We're going to break Bayside High School. Bayside High School. We're kind of rivals right there. All right, so in case you didn't know, once again, it is Distinctive Gourmet at the Virginia Beach Convention Center. You can find out all the information you need online at vbconventioncenter.com or give them a call at 385-2000. Here he goes, wrapping up his shrimp and grits. Check it out once before we go to the buzz. Robert Arnold, everybody. Boom, just like that. Can't wait to try it, Robert. Wow.